What's good everybody, it is your boy the Super Triple J-E-T here and you haven't noticed the Resident Evil 4 remake has been announced and this started up a whole conversation around the internet stating what features will be returning from OG to remake but the biggest features that people have been iffy about is QTEs. QTEs are a big staple in Resident Evil 4 but a lot of fans have stated that they don't like the QTE scenarios in Resident Evil 4. In fact, some people downright despise it. So in this video, I'm going to explain why the QT scenarios should be in the Resident Evil 4 remake. Okay, I'm going to be really honest with y'all and I'm going to say that, yeah, I really like QTEs. I've always loved them in the games I play, especially in Resident Evil 4. So the video could end right here because I really like QTEs, but I want to explain why it should at least stay in the Resident Evil 4 remake. And one of the reasons is that it always kept you on your toes. While you're playing the game, there's always those moments where you're just walking normally, all of a sudden a QTA scenario happens, either it'll be life or death or you just lose some health. Whatever the case, it always kept you on your toes, especially in the cutscenes where you always have to keep focus within the story and make sure that nothing like that happens where you can get easily killed just by missing a QT scenario. Sure some people do not like that feature and they just like why did you have to do that? We could have just saw this whole Krauser fight without the QT scenario or throwing the knife is not that big of a deal. But like I stated I always like that it kept you on your toes. Plus it was never really gameplay replacing it was mostly cinematic which I always enjoyed. There was never a situation where you could just look at the game and say what was the point of this? Maybe the laser room, but that's probably just it. Mostly because that whole scenario was just out of the ordinary. But I'm just rambling. To be honest, I don't think QTEs are going to be in the Resident Evil 4 remake. Most likely because in the last few titles, we haven't really been seeing them. Sure, we could count those little scenarios when you get attacked by a zombie and the smallest moment of Resident Evil 3 remake, but they have not been prominent since Resident Evil 6. For the tone and the style the game is trying to be, QT scenarios doesn't seem like it will work. Mostly because it looks like they're toning down a lot of the action segments, which is kind of disappointing, but... It is what it is. But if there is a small chance that the QT scenarios come back, I just want one thing to not make them colorful. But I think that's my time. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Tell me in the comments down below why don't you want to see or why do you want to see QTEs in the remake? So thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I am out. Deuces.